what's up guys i'm back with another video for you guys today so basically this is like a motivational video in a way right so and kind of an advice video um who cares what people think of you right so i figured why not i should do a video because i can relate to this very well and from personal experience right so um to tell you the truth y'all Whoever's doing their thing, grinding, working hard, trying to make a name for himself, you should not care what people think of you because if you do, it can deter you from the goal you're trying to reach. Um, jeez, man, I have so many stories about this happening to me so many dang times. This all happened when I was back in school, middle school high school never happened to me in elementary school because one you're you're basically a kid so nothing really happens when you're a kid you know what i mean but middle school um sometime in middle school i was still recovering from my brother's death back in 2012 so what i would do um and then i started i, I started getting into music right i started writing writing rhymes to cope with that fact uh, i started writing rhymes and then i actually started actually rapping it like speak it and i ain't gonna i ain't gonna lie i i sucked at first i sucked at first and then uh you know people started bugging um saying you suck you suck at dancing, you suck at this, you suck at that, right? So to tell you the truth, I just let them speak, man. I let them I let them speak because I started to realize people were mad that they're unable to do it. They're not as gifted as me. Right? This ain't no ego, this ain't my ego talking, this is just in general, because not everybody can do what you can do. And I, I want people to understand that there will be there are things that other people can do that you can't do and they hate that they're jealous of that and also they lack the determination to actually do it than you like so many people so many people told me i can't dance i can't sing i can't do this i can't do that right but what's funny this been they've been messing with they I got messed with in middle school yeah I got messed with in middle school I was like at this point I'm gonna just stay quiet because I'm not trying to cause any attention and I'm not trying to fight nobody for a dumb reason so yeah I would just go to school work what's funny is that all these people that would mess with me try to ask me for answers and I went like nah nah why should I give why like I asked myself why should I give them answers and you know why i actually i actually work hard to get where i'm at i'm not gonna let, I'm, not, I'm not gonna help y'all so y'all can take the easy route which by the way most of most of them did most of them did they took they chose lesser classes like basic level as time moves on you're supposed to go to high level classes to expand your knowledge not the easy route, you know what I mean? But they do. That's them. It's not me. I'm a hard worker. I like to expand my knowledge the best way I know how. By the time I got into high school, my dad had me read an entire dictionary to increase my vocabulary. Man, when I write, when I love writing, whether if it's an essay or whatever the case, it's not that hard to do and how to put a whole essay together. It's not hard. Right, so as time moved on, you know, I started really taking music to the next level. I started posting it on SoundCloud. Then I started making a name for myself in school. Um, and then I joined the dance team in my high school. If anybody, want, if any of you all, y'all want to know, the school that I went to is Edgewood High School, located in Maryland. So I went there. I went to high school. And I was on the dance team. 
three years, three long years, I was on that dance team, and I finally got the chance to express myself because I'm with other people like me. But in between, there was only me and one other person that they saw was gifted, and they hope I, some of them, they actually believe I'll become famous one day. Um, to tell you the truth, even if I do, I don't really care about the fame. I just want, like, one day I want to leave a legacy behind, right? So, yeah, still people said you suck at dancing, blah, 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 blah. But what's funny is that I didn't expect to become one of the most famous kids in high school. And also, I never talked down on nobody, man. I never talked down on nobody. If you're trying to reach something, I'm going to just tell you to keep pushing and keep practicing to perfect it. Because I know it's the right thing to do. I don't talk down on people saying they suck. You know what I mean? I never care. I never, I, I care. I'm a very caring person. So I just never see the reason why I should, I never saw the reason why people get talked down on. I never understood it. I never understood how you can talk down on somebody who can end up achieving something above you one day in the future. You know, like people don't, people don't, under, people don't care about people's feelings and it's annoying. But that's, that's the way the world is, man. I mean, I mean, that's the way the world is, man. So, and then I got through high school and I'm not gonna lie, dancing, I've been dancing since I was a toddler, man. I'm not, it was great, man. And I, like, to me, I never cared. I don't care if people say I suck. I never did. Because at the end of the day, I know I'll get better. And I have gotten better, man. Just, like, I'm in the Army now. And, and I still do it in my spare time, whenever. And I write music. I write music, man. I love music. I have written over 900 songs alone since 2012 that that does not bother me it doesn't bother me at all people can say us you gotta understand not everybody's gonna like your content not everybody's gonna like your content and that's a fact i'm not gonna i'm not gonna not everybody's gonna like my music you know i'm gonna be 100 percent honest not everybody's gonna like my music and that's and that's the truth and i can accept that i can accept that you know Right now, I got music on all platforms. And I gotta say, I'm loving the progress, man. With time and consistency, you progress, you get better, and then boom. You might give it time, give it a couple years or so, you you will eventually reach where you reach that point where you met your goals and you set new goals to overcome what you did in the past. It's not a bad idea, but I never cared about what people think of me. And I'm telling y'all to all my subscribers, y'all should do the same. Y'all should not care what people say. You should not care what people say. You know what I mean? Recently, not too long ago, I had a person say, I don't know how to do my job. Okay. I looked, I, I just kept it, I kept it moving only because I kept it moving because at the end of the day, I know what I can do from my from my knowledge. Knowledge is key. As long your mind is your greatest weapon, and I want y'all to understand that, right? Bro, I go <laughs> as soon as I start putting my music on all, all platforms. Bro, every time I go into work, they go they they always say they always go like Young as the King. Every time I come into work, because they know I do music, you know, at the same time, I love it, but I don't know. It's just, I have been grinding. I've been proving people wrong my whole life, and I'm not going to stop now. Man, I hope one day I can work with one of the biggest artists in the world. 
do dance performances like I used to back in school. I want to I want to achieve something of a good reputation, a good life, settle down, have a family, and that's all I, that's all I really want to do. But I can tell you this, I'm not going to care about people's opinions, people's jealousy, I don't care. The reason people talk crap about you is because they're jealous of you at the end of the day. They are. They really are. I have friends, man. I tell them to keep doing what they're doing. Keep grinding, whether it's YouTube, music, whatever they have a passion for. You gotta understand, man. There's gonna be times where people are gonna try and bring you down. There will be times people are going to bring you down. And that's okay. Because at the end of the day, what are they doing with their lives? What are they doing to help them reach their goals? If I had to estimate, probably wasting time being at their family's house smoking weed all the time. If I'm not mistaken. Man, I'm, I'm in the army. I go in the army for two months. I come out. I, I mean, I, I come out of basic. I come out of basic. <clears throat> I see a whole lot of people get pregnant. A whole lot of people got pregnant. Probably asking themselves, what what am I supposed what am I gonna do? Right? I'm 20 years old. I have no kids. I have a girlfriend, a potential wife, maybe. We just I gotta see where the relationship goes. But I want y'all to understand, no matter how far people bring you down, keep doing your passion. The more you do it, you'll keep you. The more you do it, you're gonna get somewhere. I'm trying to reach a goal myself, and I do want to do music one day. I want to one day be in a TV show. I one day be in a movie. But at the end of the day, it just takes time. I I pray that I reach at least one K streams. By the end of 2021, I'm already at close. To, I'm already close to 300. So I believe I'll probably exceed that goal, and I'm be happy for it. And I'm gonna stay independent. Some of these record labels, you just can't trust. And plus, most of that money goes to the label. It doesn't go to you. You could probably get like 10 or 5 percent of it. Five or ten percent of it at most. But I just want y'all to know no matter what people say about you, you should not care. You shouldn't care because you know yourself. Um, I hope you guys like this video. Please subscribe, share this video with your friends. And I'm pretty sure most of them that actually have a passion for something and that continue to grind, keep doing it, man. Keep doing it. And I promise you, you'll be better for it. At the end of the day. But this is Young, Young House the King signing off, and I hope y'all have a very blessed day. Peace.